are back in Laughlin. We are going to be staying at Harrah's, which we haven't stayed there. Yeah, was it, it's been like three or four years. Yeah, it's been quite a while. We stayed there during COVID because they were doing flights um, at that time out of Long Beach when we lived in California. So we would take it that way. But other than that, we've been staying at the Riverside or the Nugget. Um, so we're looking forward to it. We did request the South Tower because we've heard the rooms are quite a bit more updated. And um, we're looking forward to checking it out. We'll show you our room. It's pretty hot. It's 106. So uh, we're going to attempt to walk. And if anyone stayed at Harrah's, you know it's pretty far up the hill. So at least we'll be going down when we uh, head down into town once we get checked in and such. But we'll show us, show you our room when we get checked in. We'll go from there. Thanks, guys. So we are heading in right now, as you can see, and we're going to park in the structure, which if we recall correctly, we think it's a little bit of a walk from the self-parking to the South Tower, but we'll go get checked in first and kind of get the lay of the land, head up to the room and see what we're dealing with. And um, we'll certainly uh, show you and let you know what we think. You guys, so we um, are getting ready to head up to our room. The casino looks really empty, as you can see. I mean, not many people at all, which is really nice. We're here in the South Tower. And we'll show you what it looks like when we get up there. Hey guys, we just got checked in and we're in the South Tower, 11th floor, Riverview, room 44. Okay, you guys, we are in our room. We actually have a corner room, which is pretty cool. So to the left is the bathroom, good size lighting mirror, big vanity, which is always nice all your stuff around the commode and a nice shower now we've stayed in a room like this before where it's not a complete door and water gets all over the floor we've had this issue before but it's just an interesting design they're doing these days so uh, looks very nice and clean which we like we'll check out the pressure later and the closet's kind of hokey. It's like a shower curtain or a curtain curtain for a door, which I think could have done a little better with that. But there is a safe in there. I always like that. So I would say the bedding looks nice. The beds look nice. And over here, there's a little dresser with a refrigerator in here. So, is it cold? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Okay. Important. Um, good size TV, let's say. So, we have two sets of windows since we're on a corner, which is pretty cool. So, we can see the beach, the river, obviously. And then we have a little, let's see if I can get it in, table and chairs in the corner here. And then... The view out these windows, it's just beautiful. We have a really good view, I really like this. Uh, like we said, 11th floor in the South Tower. So we're gonna go get all our stuff and hit the casinos and we'll check in with you guys later.
loved our room, but not so much. <laughs> yeah, our experience was very different than we've had in the past. It's been, you know, several, I guess a few years maybe since we'd yeah. stayed there. Um, so we were in the South Tower, and um, first of all, our air conditioning did not cool the room at all. And it was like 110 almost, I think, during the day. So yeah. that room just yeah. stayed so hot. And um, it just like wasn't circulating or, oh, I don't know. It was miserable. And you couldn't have the curtains open because the sun was shining and making it hotter. So it was like this dark, hot <laughs> room. Yeah, it was, <laughs> it was like nobody wanted to be in the room, let's yeah. just say. Yeah, maybe that's their whole uh, strategy to get you to go down to the casino because you don't want to stay in the room. Yeah, and, and so um, before I forget too, when we first checked in, like at first glance, everything looked clean. It was a, and it was a nice room. It was good size, Oops, yeah. you know, had a good view and everything. Had a great view. But um, upon closer inspection, it had not been vacuumed. I don't even want to tell you some of the things we found on the carpet, but suffice it to stay, say I stayed in my flip flops, you know, until they came and vacuum because it was gross and um, I don't know how else to say it except the toilet seat was gross right like yeah, it was it just was thrashed like broken and, and thrashed yeah it looked like it was 30 years old or something yeah I mean because the room had been recently renovated what the heck happened there yeah so clearly they didn't renovate the toilet yeah which is gnarly <laughs> and um, the AC so two really important things in the hotel room um, and also, the shower never got hot. The shower never got hot. Which, you know, it's not like we wanted long hot showers, but because it was so hot in that room, but yeah. I mean, the water was cold. Even if you let it run, it never even got warm. Yeah, it was, yeah, just not good. Just yeah. our overall experience um, was not pleasant. And um, not that this is related to our room, but to the Harris property, poor Mr. G3, ate a smash burger and got totally sick. Oh, yeah. So that was not made pleasant it, made either. It worse. That just like topped made it worse. everything yeah. off. So I don't think we'll be staying at Harrah's again. Yeah, so it's yeah. too bad because a couple years ago we really liked that tower in the room. I don't know, and maybe because we didn't stay there in the summer and the air conditioner and for whatever yeah. reason the shower was working. I don't, it was weird. Yeah. It was just bad. Yeah, it's just we really pretty much didn't want to be in the room at all. So um, we weren't, but it was very hot, but um, machines were pretty tight, I think too, at yeah, Harris. Yeah. yeah, so, you know, overall, I would definitely, um, you know, take those things in consideration. And obviously we don't know if that's what you would find in every room. Yeah, maybe it was a one-off, I don't know. But um, our room, not so good, yeah. Wouldn't recommend, I think, you know, we really prefer the Riverside. We actually like Golden Nugget. And we've been talking, we need to go back to Aquarius. Yeah, we would stay there in a long Aquarius, time, too. You know, so. I think, especially, you know, one of the things we quickly found out, if it's summertime and you're at Harris and you got to do a lot of walking, that's probably not the best time of year to be up there. You're probably better off down near Aquarius or Nugget where you can walk to the other casinos. Because we still did, but that's a long walk in the heat. Yeah, it was so hot. And those stairs to get up to, yeah. like, street level were killer for sure. So, um yeah, I, I, I would say, yeah, and you know, maybe that's it, just stay away from the Harrah's South Tower during the summer, I don't know, you know, yeah, I don't yeah. know, but uh, that was our experience, let us know if you've stayed there, what you think, and uh, we pre appreciate you guys watching, thanks guys.